So one other thing that I think can be triggering for a lot of people that are either currently going through a chronic illness or maybe they have a dear friend or loved one or parent or sibling that has a chronic illness, hearing that on some level like we chose this can can be very triggering, that somehow I chose this illness for me. And, and so I'm just curious, having gone through it, and we'll go into your experience of having the heightened awareness to seeing how on some level you needed that to be able to refine and actually discover your authentic self. Um, what do you say to those people that are triggered by that thought that okay. I chose it? So first of all, um, I would not use the word chose because mm. I didn't choose it. So um, usually what I say is take responsibility for it, but it's not your fault. You didn't consciously choose it. Um, whereas if you don't take any responsibility for now healing it, um, when we don't take responsibility, what we're saying is, I am the victim of this. And when you are a victim of something, you become helpless. And when you're helpless, that's when there's nothing I can do about it because I'm a victim of the situation. It happened to me. I can't control it. What I'm trying to say is, no, you didn't choose it because you were doing the best you can and it, whatever you were doing brought this on. Um, but the reason it came on is because of certain things and actions and choices that that we made in our lives that led us to this point of having this diagnosis, but we can look back and reverse engineer it. In other words, I don't want you to be a victim of your illness because we actually, one of the things I discovered is that we do have more autonomy over our lives than we have ever been led to believe. 